Uh-oh, Pornhub found itself on the naughty list this weekend. Hi, this is Lindy Kaiser with clearancejobs.com. Not my first video update, update about pornography and your security clearance, surely not my last. But the news broke this weekend that the website Pornhub had its official accounts channels banned from both YouTube and TikTok amid ongoing continuous allegations that the company Pornhub is profiting from child pornography. In a real example of the pot calling the kettle black, TikTok has referred to Pornhub as a predatory app in its announcement that the official channel would be banned. Um, again, all of these are video sharing platforms. All of these have really um, high engagement rates. I'm clearly posting this update on YouTube because there's a lot of engagement on video platforms. So there's definitely um, just interesting buzz around this. Again, it's something that we have warned about for a while. Um, there was actually a RAND report that was really interesting talking about kind of young people um, and specific security clearance pitfalls that are unique to the newest generation. Pornography and the prevalence of it is absolutely one of them. Uh, our most popular article on clearance jobs last month was actually security clearance sex talk. Um, again, a common question is sexual behavior is one of the adjudicative guidelines. I'm not really asked about sexual issues in the SF-86 security clearance application. How could sex actually come up in the security clearance process? This Pornhub example is a clear one where it could. So if you are going for a higher level IC polygraph, um, if you are applying again for certain intel agencies, you might face additional questions, law enforcement agencies specifically as well, about if you have ever viewed child pornography and Pornhub's continuing issues with child pornography should be just a, a big red flag. Um, and again, I don't like to call it any, any single application. I think there's probably enough blame to go around um, the pornography business. So I just think it is consumer beware. There is so much content out there. I say this as um, the self-professed queen of content, but you really have to be careful about the content that you're consuming and making sure that it is legitimate and legal. Um, and again, in the case of pornography, um, non-consensual pornographic material, child pornography, um, you should not get anywhere near that with a 10 foot pole. I don't care who you are. This is your mom talking. Um, so just consuming that content is just something to be aware of. Um, and yeah, absolutely. It will affect your clearance eligibility if you are found to um, be viewing child pornography or any kind of pornographic material um, that has illegal origins. Um, so just really be careful about what you're watching online. Never, ever do it. Anything, anything uh, related to Pornhub or any other site on a government device. Um, but again, these newest allegations should definitely consider red flags. We could see more questions specifically about Pornhub come up in um, a security clearance background investigation um, in the course of questions or um again, polygraph processes, just because that site is coming under so many issues for that. So if you find yourself really addicted to Pornhub or having issues with that, please get help. I had someone reach out to me um, and made a great point. Um, if there are sexual issues, there is, um, you know, Sexual Addicts Anonymous. There are a number of support groups. There are things out there. We shouldn't stigmatize any issue. I think mental health has gotten a huge um, push. People are promoting, you know, mental health issues and being proactive and getting help. The same should apply for sexual behavior issues. Don't let shame um, keep you from going to get help if you have a pornography addiction. Proactively seeking help for any issue, if it's porn or anything else, is the best step that you can take your, your security clearance. Um, continue to do it. And then again, falling into this trap of viewing content that um, in some cases is illegal is definitely gonna put your security clearance in jeopardy. So for more information on uh, sexual behavior and the security clearance process and this latest um, hit against Pornhub, visit our new site over at clearancejobs.com.